Professor Willem Tarkan and researchers from Wageningen University in the Netherlands and ICIPE in Kenya have achieved a breakthrough in the fight against malaria worldwide. A specially designed odobated trap that catches malaria mosquitoes, combined with mosquito nets, drugs and a thorough social strategy, was tested for three years, resulting in the reduction of the malaria mosquitoes by 70% by catching them. This is the first study of malaria worldwide that took place in real-life circumstances. Instead of laboratory testing, the pioneering and innovative research was being done on Rusinga Island in Lake Victoria in Kenya. The invention is that we have a mosquito trap here where when the fan of the trap works, mosquitoes are being sucked in here uh, and they're drawn to this trap or attracted to it by odors that are being blown out through these tiny little holes. Well, the greatest invention is, of course, the odor that is in here together with the trap. One of the great advantages is that it diminishes the need for pesticides for which mosquitoes become increasingly resistant. The odor traps need electricity. That was not an issue, but another important part of the success. Solar panels were installed to run the odor traps. These panels also provided the people with lighting in the house. It's on. And a battery to recharge their mobile phones. On top of it all, the social strategy and involvement of local people proved very important, and a lot of awareness was created around malaria. By this combined approach, all 25,000 people on Rusinga Island participated in the study. The odor-baited trap can be applied as a new and sustainable way of combating malaria, still one of the most deadly illnesses.